Hey everyone, this is Polar and I am back again for another installment of the UDK top-down shooter that I have been working on. Um, basically it's going to be much of the same as the last video, I just wanted to do an update and there's a good reason why it's pretty much uh, a lot of the same as the previous videos. Basically one, uh, I was sick for like a week and a half, like no joke. Uh, two, I work 40 plus hours a week. I want to say plus usually that's 50 to 60 hours a week three I'm also still in school and four I have a life just like many of you black ops 2 came out I was playing it I'm not gonna lie not to mention I do a lot of bike riding so yeah I was a little busy but besides all that I'm feeling pretty good I hope you guys are feeling good too we're gonna just go over this like I said this uh, if you're following this video series from previous installments I am making a UDK top-down shooter based on the video out by E3D. If you have not gone to E3D or purchased any of their videos and would really like to get into, say, if you want to learn how to do the stuff I'm doing or or you want to make your own game or whatever, I highly suggest going to somewhere like E3D. That's where I learned a lot of the stuff I use and I put on my YouTube pages. I would probably say there's a few online distributors out there and I'm going to say, I'm going to probably put for my top three, E3D is probably number one. Followed by Noman Workshop and Digital Tutors. They're all really good. It's really worth the money. If you really want to do this, you're passionate about making video games. If you're passionate about making the 3D art, learning how to put it into, say, UDK, CryEngine, whatever, you should really look into investing in something like that that have various options of payment. Some sell DVDs, some do monthly subscriptions, whatever you want, they probably got it. If you want to learn how to do something, they can probably teach you. But as I said earlier, I am pretty excited and the reason I am excited because I am actually going to pay off my new bike this weekend and I'm going to take it out and tear it up. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to uh, put it through the ringer as best as I can. So I'm pretty stoked about it. But I'm pretty sure you guys are probably thinking to yourself, well, let's talk more about the uh, UDK top-down shooter and we are I'm just kind of shooting the breeze because like I said you know a lot of this part of, of me doing this really isn't a tutorial it's more just you know I'm doing this for mostly my portfolio to show you what I can do and not to mention that the uh, e3d has put out this DVD which I'm trying to follow along with and I don't want to give it all away because I think that would be kind of cheating them out and I really suggest if you want to do what I'm doing here to actually go to the website and, and purchase the video but actually I had other thoughts about this uh, level itself I really do want to get done to the portions of the E3D video and add a lot of my own stuff to this and a lot of the stuff I wanted to add to it was um, I picked up a student edition of flash and I really wanted to get into scale form and make some menus and such if anything I want to add like say like you know a start or exit menu at the beginning of the game because I do intend to distribute this uh, not to have anyone pay for it obviously it's just gonna be one level but just so I can get it out uh, show an example of my work so even if you guys are following along with the uh, the videos here and want to have a chance to play it on your PC hopefully you'll have the chance to do so uh, like I said like uh, there's a scale form I want to work with that basically helps you with your menus and your HUDs I also want to add some some more of my own assets and lighting if you see in the video now I did tweak some of the lighting around a bit already and just you know it is gonna be a follow along video I'm doing but I do want to add a lot of my own stuff to it so it kinda I guess you could say stands out show you what I can do as far as yeah I can follow along this video and make this but also I can do other stuff as well but all that will be in uh, due time because I still gotta finish following along with the E3D video and add my stuff and then I'll figure out a way to distribute it somehow on a website paste the link and so hopefully like I said you guys can download it play it check it out tell me what you think that kind of thing also uh, I had put up some uh, pictures on Twitter which I recently got involved with Twitter and if you follow me on Twitter you will notice I tweet a lot might be a good idea if you're really interested or like what I do follow me on Twitter because it shows I put up stuff on there like uh, for instance if you follow me on Twitter I put up a link to a, another level that I'm working on which is not listed on my channel and uh, so if you follow me on Twitter you get to see some other stuff I'm doing right now as well not to mention a lot of the boring stuff that I do everyday life ride bikes uh, make stupid comments about this or that and retweet a lot of stuff that I find relevant in my 
daily activities so anyway like i said uh, i do have twitter if you want to follow me at twitter it is like in my f beginning of my videos where it says it's like at and it's ww polar ww all together so if you want to follow me at twitter we'll do it again you go at ww p o l a r w w and you can just follow me along and see all the other stuff i've been doing and I'm going to cut it short there, folks. I will have some more videos up sometime in the near future. All right, take it easy.